the Bible to the cross from the cross. Every Bible story has three components. First, God's law. Second, God's compassion. Third, God's miracle. Opening your Bible opens miracles. The Bible as one story is holy enough in our lives. Day 107 to Samuel 15, Psalm 3 The story of Coup de Tat 1 Absalom's Rebellion Shocked by Absalom's rebellion, which was thoroughly prepared, David hurriedly left Jerusalem and yet established a strategy to resist the rebelling army in face. First point. The biggest problems David endured internally during his political life was firstly in Ziglag with the 600 people who tried to stone him, and secondly, the instant of Absalom's coup d'etat. The first internal danger David endured was before he became king over Judah. The second was Absalom's coup d'etat. External fights require courage, but internal fight is a whole new type of battle. The reason David managed to be God's servant right until the end was because he managed to endure these internal fights by always putting God first. Second point, Absalom used his biased judgment skills in front of the palace doors and also the instant at Hebron as the base for his coup d'etat. Absalom's coup d'etat had several stages. The first was to gather his army of followers. The second was for him to make himself the judge, state how his father had faults and how he was the suitable king. Another tool that he used was the help from a counselor. Ahithophel was David's counselor who was acknowledged for his skills. Absalom turned Ahithophel into his side and thus strengthened his chances in becoming king. Most unfortunately, Absalom used the offerings to God in Hebron for his coup d'etat. Absalom gathered 200 people for the coup d'etat. Third point, when David was chased by Saul, he at least had a rope to hang from, but when he was chased by Absalom, he had to learn barefoot. Although David experienced a great deal of hardship during his lifetime, this incident with Absalom was indeed one of his worst. But David did not complain and instead looked back on his sins with the Bathsheba and also how he failed to properly punish Amnon after he had left his sister Tamar. David also acknowledged how he did not notice that Absalom had been making opposition in Israel during the past four years. The reason why David ran out barefoot was because he did not want to make war with his own son in Jerusalem where God's presence dwelt. He also wanted to strategically think about how to handle this coup d'etat. Fourth point, whilst learning away, David knew that monarch could change any day. On his learning away from Absalom, the priest Zadok and Abiathar followed him, carrying the ark of God with them. But David had the ark sent back to Jerusalem. The reason for doing so was because David accepted God's anger, and also because David hoped for God's forgiveness. And so he sent the ark back with the people who brought it with them. Fifth point. In order to compete with Ahithophel, David sent Hushai to Absalom. The news that Ahithophel had united with Absalom would have been the most disheartening news for David. 
David knew that with Ahithophel on Absalom's side, Absalom had very high chances of succeeding his coup d'etat. The only thing David was able to do was to pray to God to make Ahithophel's plans foolish. But during this disheartening situation, David came across a new opportunity. God answered his prayer by sending him Hushai, and thus David was able to turn the tables. David convinced Hushai to go to Absalom and release false information. An ordinary war depends on the sword, but this war was down to the counselors. This was a war between Ahitophel and Hushai. This Tong Doc app is amazing. When I first met Dr. Zhou, we were speaking together at a conference. And when I saw the Tong Bible and the way he had placed this one story together, the Bible, one story, I ordered cases of this Bible. Now to see this app, the Tong Doc app, ready for you to use in your daily Bibles reading. This is amazing because so many people tell me I don't understand the Bible. And he has placed it in an order as so that it is one story. And then day after day takes you through the Bible in a way that God's Word will touch your heart so deeply that it changes your beliefs. It helps you to rise up and be the amazing person he created you to be. Welcome to the Tong Dog app.